Hi, I'm Papia. In this problem, we have to find the exact value of this given expression without using a calculator. So, let's see if we can apply various properties of logarithm to simplify this expression. Okay, so the second term is logarithm of 3 base 5. There isn't much you can do with that. So, let's see if we can rewrite 75 somehow. And you know we can. 75 is 3 times 25. Now, as soon as you wrote 75 as a product of two numbers, you can apply a property of logarithm to break them apart. And what is the property? Well, we know that logarithm of, say, u times v is equal to logarithm of u plus logarithm of v. And you can have any base. Okay. So, this is exactly the situation we have. We have u times v here. So, you can break it apart as a sum of two logarithms. So, let's do that. This will be equal to logarithm base 5 of 3 plus logarithm base 5 of 25. And then you still have negative logarithm base 5 of 3. Well, notice that there's a positive and a negative, so those two will cancel. And you will end up having just logarithm base 5 of 25. Now the question is, is that it or can we go further? Well, you see, there's a base 5 and we have some 5's here in the 25. So let's rewrite that. This is logarithm base 5, 25 is 5 square. Well, as soon as you have u to the power n, you can apply another well-known property of logarithm. And the property is, if you have logarithm base a, of u to the power n, this is equal to n times logarithm of u base a. So log brings down the exponent n. Well, here this is my u and 2 is n. So we can apply the property and we will have this is equal to n times, so 2 times logarithm of u, which is 5, with a base 5. Well, notice, here we have logarithm of 5 and the same base is 5. So we know another property, right? Logarithm of a, with a base a, is equal to 1. So we can apply that property here and we'll get 2 times 5 is a and same base, so 2 times 1. And therefore, answer is 2. So it is possible to simplify this expression and find the exact value without using a calculator. Thank you.